Africa has about 25.9 million people living with HIV AIDS, which is 65% of the global burden of HIV AIDS, with Nigeria contributing about 1.9 million, making it the fourth largest HIV burden country globally. The International Research Center of Excellence at the Institute of Human Virology in Nigeria has extended efforts to develop an effective HIV vaccine to West Africa, made up of eight African countries led by the president of the South African Medical Research Council. HIV VITSTA study is going to offer us hope for a vaccine that is tailored to the needs of our population. And Nigeria's involvement in this global initiative is very critical. Our participation supports both local and international efforts to end AIDS and bring us closer to a vaccine that would save countless lives across the African region, African continent, and even beyond. UNAIDS says capacity building among youths and community education and awareness remain key to HIV elimination by 2030. I want to advocate so that we really use this to build the capacities, capacity of Nigerians, young Nigerians, you know, so who will stay and continue to use the platform so for, so for something else. Second will be engaging the communities. They play a key role so in that process. I really want to advocate and plead that more effort is put into building capacity and then engaging the community that will play a key role. The President's Emergency Plan for AIDS Relief, PEPFAR, believes that both research and science are critical and pivotal foundational um, enablers to ensure that we collectively join efforts to reach ending HIV as a public health threat by 2030. In Nigeria, USAID says it is working with NAVDAC to ensure certification for manufacturing vaccines in the country. We are also working closely with um, NAVDAC to achieve level four uh, maturity certification. Now, this is a critical requirement on the journey to manufacturing of uh, vaccines. We, as Nigerians, we are proud to have the Institute of Human Biology of Nigeria serve as the sole West African site. A representative from the Institute of Human Virology in Nigeria breaks down the stage of the vaccine production. We're having a technology transfer in terms of putting vaccine constructs together. We're having technology transfer in terms of doing all the immune assays that would establish whether it is immunogenic, it is protective or not. We're having the technology to also test that it is safe within our population. Many here hope that this initiative will be effective in vaccine production to curb the spread of HIV AIDS in Nigeria and across the continent. Oli J. Wapera, Arise News.